Okay, the first thing you'll need to do is to look at your look at your video planning from the other day and you'll use that information to help you write your script. The point of this is to tell people what's going on and then ask them to come. That's where we start and keep it simple. Just think of the commercials that we watched. They told people what was happening and they showed them some video and pictures of these places and we'll keep it simple from there and if we want to be more creative we can add it in after we get started. So first let's just start with what information we're going to share. Um, I know that I want to start, I'm going to start with a question because that's what I like to do and so I'm going to start with a question first. Would you like to learn more about Goshen New Tech Middle School? I'm just going to write that down. And then we have this question, and that lets people know that we're probably going to answer it. So then we begin to answer that. Um, I have to think about who is it? The So New Tech students and staff invite you to come check out the work that we do and remember keep thinking back to the why why are we doing this we want parents and students to learn and want them to know that they can how it benefits them how it helps them and then also can help prepare them for what they want to do after high school whether it's colleges or a good job and so that's what parents want to know about. And so we're going to see if we can help people with that. We want uh, the New Tech students and staff invite you to come check out the work that we do on November. The date is November 4th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. Write out the word T-O there so that you know. Don't use a dash. That will get confusing for you. On November, on November 6th and 4th from 6 to 7.30, you have the chance to come visit classrooms. Think about what's going to be happening. We're going to visit classrooms. We're going to be able to talk to teachers. We're going to be able to talk to students. And what else is going to be able to happen? They're going to be able to see the projects that you're doing. So that's like three sentences right there. So you will have the chance to come visit classrooms and talk and let's do this and experience because I think Mrs. Schreiner in her um, information sheet said experience. Spirit, um, I misspelled that. And you're an experience what Experience the projects that we are creating. Okay. Put a space between each sentence just so that way you have, you know that it's a new thought and that it's, um, that there's space to be able to read it when you need to read it. Let's see, we already said you, so let's start with something new. What else is happening? Students will be here to explain the work that they have done and tell you about their projects, right? Because that's what parents want to see. Think about what a parent wants to see. A parent wants to see their kid doing something, and so that's what we're going to show them. And then what would parents want to know from teachers? Well, they would want to learn from teachers how, how challenging it is that their students are going to be able to learn and be successful. So we can go back and say the word you. You can talk with teachers and principals 
to find out more about the ways that new tech can prepare your student, your child. Let's change it to child. Child is a little more personal. Prepare your child for college, college or other careers that they might have. Okay, so there you go. So we've got some more. Is there any more information that we can put on here? Let's go back and look at our notes. Okay, new tech students and teachers, showing projects, explaining project-based learning. Well, we didn't really talk about that, but maybe we can. We have when. I don't know, do we have where? I might need to go back and fix that. And then we want parents and students to learn how new tech can benefit students and prepare them for what they want to do after high school. So I think we've got, that's the important stuff right there, this one right here. That's really what's going to, that's what parents want to know about. And that's our main audience. We do want the kids to come, but the parents are our main audience. Um, so you can talk with parents and teachers. Talk to teachers and principals to find out more about the ways that new tech will. Instead of can, can makes it seem uncertain. So let's change it to will. Will prepare your child for college or other careers that they might have. Okay. So I think we could, I don't know, what do you think about maybe having a student say something? So I'm going to put that in here. I'm going to put, so this will be, I got to, I need to also say who's saying the line. So this is going to be Mr. Sapp. And then I'm going to change this, and I'm going to have a student. I don't know what student I'm going to pick yet. So you can raise your hands now if you want. Student. And the student will... I'm going to mark this. I'm going to make it bold so I know it's different. Talk about one of the their favorite things about learning through projects. Okay, so that's what we want to hear. We want to hear how they learn. We want a student to tell us how they learn using projects. Okay, and we have to think long term. We don't have to think every day. Some days you have to sit and you have to practice math, math facts. But other days you get to learn how to use the math facts. And then so the student will say that. And then I'm going to finish and I'm going to go back to Mr. Sapp. And I'm going to tell parents to come on out. So come out to Goshen Middle School on November 4th from 6 to 7.30 and bring your student so you can learn about the great things we're doing here at Goshen okay so I've been writing for 20 years so this is very easy but when thinking back what do I want to say I want to tell where and what and then one more reason one more time just telling them what they're going to learn okay so what do we want? We want them to bring their student so that they can experience and learn about the great things we're doing here at Goshen New Tech Middle School. Okay, so that's that's that. Hmm, but there's nothing in here. Like there's no, I don't know what I'm going to see. So that's what the direction side is for. And so I'm going to do, I'm going to make this bold so that I know that it's different. And Mr. Sapp is going to be on camera, on camera. And then... I want to, we want to start seeing some video. So I'm going to write video of projects. So that I know that the video of the projects will cover this stuff right here. Actually, I might put text on the screen. Maybe while I'm talking, I'll put text. So let's put this down here and then do text with date. Okay, and then let's see. 
video of the projects, we'll keep going, and then we'll have student interview here, and then we will continue Mr. S we don't I don't know, we have to think, do we want to see me again or do we want to just go? I think that I'm going to show some more video, video of projects. And then I'm going to also do text with date and place. Okay, so there we go. So I have this telling me, oh, but what am I going to hear? We all love a little bit of music. We want to make sure that maybe we'll put some music in here. And I'm going to put music low in background. Okay. And so I'm going to adjust these returns. Okay. So now I have directions. And now I have a script. And the script has who's talking. It has what they're saying. I used capitals and punctuation, and then I gave the who, the what, the when, the where, and the why. So if you go back and look, I've used all of our information from our planning sheet that we used yesterday. So good luck, and if you have any questions, make sure you ask.